Hi, Jasmine. How are Hi, you? Hi, Jasmine. Hey, Jasmine. Oh, connecting. Oh, she can't hear us yet. Yeah. yeah. Now she can. Hi, Jasmine. Hi, Jasmine. Hello. Hey, Jasmine. Are you all connected hello, hello. and set up? You look fantastic. Oh, thank you so much. Yeah, I'm all set up. Good. Well, we invited you here a little bit under false pretenses. So you probably think you're here to tell Dr. Early all the things that we did right and wrong with virtual education. Um, but instead, you're here for kind of a more special individual reason. And I'm going to turn it over to Dr. Lai to explain to you what that is. Nikki, we're all yours. Hi, Jasmine. How are you? Good to see Good. you. How are you? You too. So usually, kind of this week during um, the end of your fourth year is our graduation banquet um, where we give out awards. And since we can't do it in person, we decided to do it virtually. And so here we are. Um, so hopefully um, you kind of get the gist of where this is going. <laughs> <laughs> I think I have an idea now. <laughs> well, Jasmine, um, I'm really honored and excited to present you with the Class of 2020 Graduate Award for the Excellence in Contact Lens Patient Care. Um, this award is provided by the American Academy of Optometry Foundation, um, which is sponsored by Johnson Johnson, as well as the GPLI um, Institute, which is sponsored by the Contact Lens Manufacturer Association. Um, it comes with some plaques to recognize your achievements and also a certificate for a fitting set. Um, the award recognizes the outstanding graduate who demonstrates excellence in contact, contact lens care. Pretty obvious, right, from the uh, title of the award. But we definitely think uh, it was voted by the faculty, and we definitely think you deserve this award. A couple of reasons. Uh, let's kind of go through your uh, history here with us in the contact lens clinic. Seems like the contact lens area came pretty naturally to you in the classroom. Um, and I say that because you like scored the highest grade <laughs> ever <laughs> in my contact lens course. You literally missed one question on the midterm. Um, and you know, that was impressive. Obviously it stood out. Uh, but really what was the most impressive was how you translated all that, um, classroom learning and cl ask classroom knowledge into, into our patient care. And, um, and obviously that's the important part in what we're looking out for. Um, you know, a couple of comments I'm going to make are consistent across from all your attendings that have mentioned it. Um, you've got, gotten a chance to work with some of our most special and difficult patients. Um, you manage them all really independently. Uh, really, what I'm always looking for is, you probably know, minimum work on my part. Um, <laughs> because you really got a grasp and a hold of, of the concepts, what to do with the patients. Um, and you, and you manage them with the ease and confidence of a seasoned clinician, um, almost like a contact lens expert. So again, really, really impressed by all that. Um, but at the same time, you were always asking questions, always looking for ways for better treatment of our patients, better options for our patients, and really learning from each experience. And so we appreciate that part as well. <laughs> Um, you know, every once in a while in our clinics, our patients kind of pull us aside and want to give us feedback, right? Either, hey, that kid does, doesn't know what they're doing, uh, but most of the time it's to give them compliments. Um, and so it's always nice to hear when, when our patients kind of can see that too and appreciate it. Uh, Jasmine, your patients do it all the time. Like they're always <laughs> like, you know, while you, when you're out of the room, they're like, hey, that was the best students I ever worked with. Um, and again, these patients, a lot of our patients have come here over and over again, year after year. Um, and so that really, really means a lot, again, to me, but also obviously to our patients and how it reflects on your patient care. Um, one of my oldest patients actually uh, asked where you were going to practice. <laughs> and um, I didn't tell her because I was afraid she was going to leave us. And come <laughs> but again, I'm really, really, really proud um, and excited that you've received this award very, very deserving. Um, I know you're going to do great things in your career. I'm looking forward to working with you some more um, in the future, hopefully, and, and hearing from you. Um, so I just, again, want to say a nice congratulations. <laughs> Thank you so much. I, I thought you're soon. not ready. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not. I was expecting <laughs> You can go do that next. Yeah. All right, round of applause. Congratulations. Yeah, congratulations. congratulations. And Jasmine, you can say a couple words if you want to. 
<laughs> yeah, I'm completely honored and surprised. Um, I always enjoyed working with you, Dr. Lai, and everybody also on the faculty. Um, so it's an honor to get the award, and I look forward to incorporating contact lenses into practice once I'm done with residency. So we'll definitely awesome. be in touch. Fantastic. Where are you going for residency? Ohio Eye Alliance. Oh, great. Great experience. Very lucky. Well, we're, we're proud to have you graduate. You'll get information about the particulars of the award, you know, in the, you know, the, the now let's see what you've won kind of email tomorrow. And okay. this is, this is a rain check for all the celebrations we would have been having these this week. So I don't know when it's going to be. I don't know what it's going to be, but um, it, we'll, we'll, we will get together. Oh, okay. Point. Okay. All right, congratulations. congratulations Thank you so Jasmine. much. Stay safe. Good job. Well done. well done. Congratulations.